This shotgun right here is the absolute pinnacle of Italian shotgun making in Italian engraving. That might be an arguable statement, but uh, if you were to argue with me, I, I, I believe you'd be wrong. So this is a Fratelli Rosini R1E side lock, side-by-side -side shotgun that was engraved by the master engraver Fermo Fricasi. Fratelli Rosini uh, is a manufacturer in the Brescia region of, uh, of Italy, um, where, you know, the vast majority of the gun making uh, businesses in Italy. Um, and they make best quality, uh, only best quality shotguns. They make anywhere from, I've heard ranges of anywhere from like 10 to 25 guns a year. But either way, it's a very, very small number of guns, all custom made guns, custom order guns. To give you an idea, this gun, um, if you were to order this, this, this gun brand new, you'd be looking at about $120,000 just for the gun. That doesn't include the engraving. Um, and you'd be waiting several years to get the gun. Now you add on the engraving, which we'll be talk about here in a, in a minute. Uh, and, and then obviously that goes up exponentially. So the, the one thing, like I said, obviously besides the fact that this is just the highest quality Italian shotgun you can buy, um, the biggest thing with this shotgun is the fact that it is engraved by the absolute best uh, engraver probably in the world today. And that's nothing against the other Italian engravers. Again, Italy has some of the top engravers in the world, but Fermo Fricasi is absolutely the best. So as you can see here, if we look closely into it, um, again, just unmistakably Fricasi is those dark clouds um, and just the contrast between the dark clouds and the light uh, in the background and just the detail of that. Um, so then as we get in the dogs, the same thing there, you can just see the, the, the depth uh, and contrast within the dogs and just how lifelike they are and how uh, anatomically correct they are. I mean, just it, it looks like an absolute picture of a dog on steel. Um, the, the, the depth and the, just even the grasses around the dogs. Um, and then here, obviously, we have a rooster pheasant. Same thing there. You just have this, this, this dark and light within the uh, engraving and, and that depth, the contrast. Um, and just the detail within within all of his engraving and, and um, again this is a, a real typical scene that you would see uh, for Cassis. So when I say this is a typical engraving of his, there's a caveat to that. Uh, uh, Mr. Fricasi does not does not engrave very many guns every year because of the amount of time he spends on one of these. So to give you an idea, um, the quintessential book on Fricasi's work, um, which came out in 2008 by Lamboy and Lamboy, uh, at that time of, of publishing in 2008, he had mentioned that he had engraved about 57 guns uh, since the 1970s. Okay, so you're talking 30 plus years, and he only engraved 57 guns in that time. So. Um, there's nothing typical about his work, but he has done some of these scenes like this with other different styles of dogs. So we can go look to the other side as well and see a very similar type pattern. On this one, you can see the setters are running. Uh, again, we have a rooster pheasant in there. Very similar scene to the other side, just kind of a different look with them running, but uh, the same quality, that same depth of the scene, the same contrast uh, between the dark and the light. Absolutely magnificent. Uh, and again, just quintessentially Fermo Fricasi. Now, as I said, we could, we could uh, Certainly picked this out as his work just by looking at the game scene, but you can see here, obviously he assigned it uh, for Cassi and Cinzioni, and then uh, Roman numerals 23, which I was not able to find exactly what that was, but if I had to guess, talking about the 57 guns he's done, that was my, this possibly was the 23rd gun that he would have engraved, so. And then here on the bottom, we see uh, one of the setters uh, with the rooster pheasant in his mouth same thing same beautiful background dark and light background same beautiful contrast so yeah you can see here as well you can see the pierce trigger guard um, which again is just just more detail it's pierced many many times in there same thing here on the top lever pierce top lever and then as we kind of go around here you can see uh, just all the the very detailed scroll engraving same kind of depth you see there between the between the scrolls just really kind of brings that that action out 
I was very, very excited to hear about this gun coming into the auction. This is one of the first Fricasse guns that we've had come through the auction. Not to mention the fact that we've had very few Fratelli Rosinis come through the auction as well, because again, they make very few guns each year. So as I said, I'm very excited for this shotgun to be coming up into our auction on August 26th, 27th, and 28th with a full day preview on August 25th. Um, please go to our website, www.rockislandauction.com to see this magnificent shotgun along with all the other items we have coming up in that sale. Once again, August 26th, 27th, and 28th with a full day preview on August 25th.